Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Tina. It's time for our daily devotional. I picked a passage today about belief in God. What is true belief in God? I used to always believe that all we had to do was just believe, and that was enough. But let's learn about what really is true belief in God. God says, A true belief in God is not about believing in Him in order to be saved, and is even less about being a good person. It is also not just about believing in God in order to have human likeness. Actually, people should not view their belief in God as just a belief that there is a God, and then nothing more. It is not that you should merely believe that God is the truth, the way, the life, and then nothing more. Nor is it just so you acknowledge God, much less is it merely to believe that God is the ruler over all things, that God is almighty, that God created all things in the world, that God is unique, and that God is supreme. It is not merely so that you believe this, rather, it is that you, your whole being, and your whole heart should follow God. Allow God to employ you, allow God to use you in his service, and that you should do anything for God. It is not that only those predestined and chosen by God should believe in Him. Actually, all of mankind should worship God, heed Him, and obey Him, because mankind was made by God. Amen. So we can see true belief in God is not about things according to our liking. (laughs) It's really about believing in God to allow God to use us so we can be one that's qualified to be used by God, to follow God with our whole being, with our whole heart, and be able to be able to use in his service as preaching the gospel um, or anything that comes upon him, like Noah. Noah was used by God as being able to build the ark. Abraham was used by God as an example of what is true faith in God. And Job was also one that was used by God as teaching mankind how to fear God and shun evil. And Peter was one also that in a sense was used by God to show us the type of love we need to have for God, that life is just not about being easy in our belief in God. Peter went through many trials, but he learned to love God throughout those trials. So belief in God is not a simple matter, as simple as just acknowledging there is a God. And this is the belief I used to have before. I remember coming across this passage one day and reading it online and it really intrigued me. And I followed this passage and this passage has led me to where I'm at today of understanding that my belief in God is not as simple as just acknowledging it, but trying to be approved by God. One that can be used in service of God's work and also learn how to be compatible with God so that I can learn actually how to love God, how to truly love God according to seeing that God allows me to live and the guiding and leading that he does upon me and the arrangements that he makes for my daily life. So I hope you like this passage today. Feel free to share your understanding about what you believe true belief in God is. Anything that you might have experienced in your belief to be able to see how your belief became stronger or your belief was one-sided like maybe mine was of understanding that belief in God is not so simple. Feel free to share your comments below. I'd like to see them and so we can all learn and grow together. God bless you. Have a wonderful day and we'll see you next time. Bye.